I really studied for this test, but when I took it, I just didn't feel like I was very prepared. I studied all weekend, but I still got a C. I went in and I felt really good about it, and when I got my grade, I just, I don't know what happened. I have no idea what is wrong. Most students are unaware of the best techniques of uh, studying for a test. I read the book, I went over all my notes, what else is there? Self-testing is the best way to prepare for the test and to understand the material on a deep level. Self-testing would help you to practice producing information before you actually get to the test. Most undergraduate tests include questions that get at three levels of learning, knowledge, understanding, and application. Levels of learning? What's that? The first level is the most fundamental level of knowledge. It's about recognizing or recalling information, facts, definitions. Something like, what is the definition of schizophrenia, or what was the date of the Cultural Revolution in China? Those kinds of things are your basic knowledge questions. Then you would move on to the comprehension, where you're able to explain in your own words what happened during that particular event. Start thinking about how that event might have affected another event down the line. The third level is application, where you transfer what you've learned and apply it to solve problems. An application is taking that knowledge, taking that comprehension, and applying it to new situations. You look at the material that the instructor's given you, break it down into these th three levels, knowledge, comprehension, application. Try to write several questions at each level and then go back through and see if you can answer your questions. You want to make sure that you match the type of questions that you're practicing to the types of questions that are going to show up on the test. Through that way of asking yourself questions, of self-testing, I think you'll be better prepared for your exam. But I'm not a professor, so how do I come up with questions? One of the things that you could do is go to the end of the chapter in every textbook. They have a list of questions. Look at those questions. You can also talk to other students. They may come up with different questions. In some classes, you may have access to old tests. You can also talk to your TA or professor. I really want to encourage students to talk to their instructors or their teaching assistants during office hours. That's their job, and they want to respond to your questions and be available to you. A really good way to get feedback is to talk to your professor or your TA. Check in with an expert. Take your questions to the professor or a TA. If you've got a discussion section, that's a really good place to ask questions and say, this is what I thought about this concept. Am I on the right track? Some other ways to match how you prepare for the test to the actual test would be randomized testing, testing under a time limit, and maybe practicing in an actual classroom where you actually set yourself a time limit, letting yourself know that you need to complete 10 questions over the course of 30 minutes and see how you do. Let's review. Self-testing is the best way to prepare for a test. Self-test at different levels of learning. Get feedback. Match how you self-test to features of the actual test.